Hi, I'm Richard from Glowing Embers and today we're talking about inset stoves um, or cassette stoves or insert stoves and sort of working out what those terms mean. Um, and this uh, is a beautiful Westfire Unique 32. Um, and this is strictly speaking a cassette stove, but also referred to as an inset stove. So um, insets and inserts are really the same thing. Cassette stoves are slightly different to an insert stove um, in terms of they have a frame around them where there's an air gap which sort of traps the hot air and sort of radiates it out. And usually the ins uh, insert cassette stoves can be put up higher in a wall, whereas an insert stove is just something that really is used to replace traditionally a, um, a, a gas fire or a gas fire with a back boiler. So where you've got a, a fireplace and it would just literally replace that. But the difference, the main difference between an insert stove and a regular stove is it's flush to the wall. And that's something that's in common with all of the stoves, an insert cassette or an inset stove. Um, and that's, that's what you see here. So with these cassette stoves in particular, you get what's quite a, a modern flush look. You just see the front of the stove. It looks a bit like a, a widescreen TV and you just get that beautiful flame effect and the heat out. Um, so the installation of these is obviously a bit more involved than a standard wood burning stove. A standard wood burning stove you just put in your fireplace and attach it to the chimney. Now with one of these they have to kind of be built in. So um, this one um, there was uh, an, an existing gas um, insert fire, fire in here. The gas was tapped off by a, a gas safe engineer uh, and then the heat ass installer came in and knocked out the chimney breast. So this is an existing chimney breast. They knocked out the existing chimney breast. This is sitting on blocks of the original fire, put the fire, uh, the flue in and then plastered around it with heat resistant plasterboard and, and made good and then you get, get your um, uh, uh, sort of flush fire like this. Now, you can fit these in uh, to, onto a wall where you don't have uh, an existing fireplace. Um, you just need to build a false wall out. You can build that with fireboard and, and use heat resistant fire, um, heat resistant um, plaster on the wall uh, to do that. Um, so you don't actually have to have uh, an existing chimney to put these in if you want this effect, but it does mean you'll have a part of your room built out a bit. Um, so there are two ways of doing it. And if you have, uh, if you build your fire out, then you're going to need to use twin wall and you just use a twin wall installation up through your house. Um, whereas with an existing chimney, it's a, it's a much easier installation and most of them do go in existing chimneys. Inset stoves come in all shapes and sizes to suit your chimney breast, from very small narrow ones, which will fit in a, a small Victorian style chimney breast, to, to really wide large ones, which are sort of stunning centerpieces. Even with sort of side glass going around a corner on the left or right side, different door options. Kratky, um, as a Polish company, they do a large amount of inset stoves for almost sort of any installation. Westfire sell a lot of beautiful stoves, uh, Arada. There's lots on our site to choose from. Give us a call, we can advise you on the best stove for you and advise you on your flue system as well. Um, if there's anything else you want, put the questions in the comments and otherwise, if you found this video useful, feel free to um, like and subscribe and we'll see you in the next video.